We have a tendency with how we have been brought up theologically to see things through exclusively human lenses and actually the Bible teaches us to, to broaden out our vision. So the Bible's story isn't only about people but it is about the land and it's about all things that God has created. I can remember my eldest daughter, she was going to a different church to me and she came back one Sunday really frustrated. It was a, an Anglican, a Lutheran church where they had set prayers and every week someone would say the prayers and they would you know, pray for different things and they would always say let's pray for the world and my daughter came back really frustrated saying mum every week we say let's pray for the world but we never actually pray for the world we just pray for the people who are in it so we pray for refugees we pray for people affected by conflict or or, or starving and so on all of which is really important and we need to pray for that but we never pray for the world. And it was such an illustration to me of how we might talk about the world, but our default is that we see that as people and we forget the much broader picture of this, this whole planet that we share with so many other species.